Good shot by Kamen. Not only seeing it, but going to get it. Sure was. I think Kamen is going to love having Baron Davis on this team. Alston into the foul circle. Burst of speed to the goal for the layup. His one, first field goal. And the one thing you don't want to let him do is he's shooting 29% from three, 27% from two. Barron for three. Bingo! You're right about Barron and the number of threes he's going to make this year. That record is toast. His first of the night, but his eighth of the year. And he's just getting going. 54 52, Houston by two. How about the Clippers starting the second half with five straight goals? Alston answers. That's what I mean about the layup. You never let a guy struggling get a layup and get feeling good. Davis undeterred. Horton hunting for freedom against our test. You know, Artes held down Brandon Roy for much of last night. He was about 4 of 16 before his late game heroics. Yeah, and made two shots in the last two seconds. He made two great shots. Yeah, he sure did. One of them, Artes fell down. The other one, there's a mix-up between him and Tracy McGrady. Anybody speak Spanish out there? They're all talking to Scola. Came and just got his third, oh, his second foul on Chris. There's 45 to go in the third. There's Luis. He basically took the Clippers to Scola in the first half. Well, he, he had 14 in the first quarter, and then the other power forward, Landry, had 10 in the second. That's 24 from the power forward. Offensive yep. foul on Scola, his fourth. So that's a big play right there. And again, a good job on Kamen. They have Kamen guarding the power forward and Skinner guarding the center. Davis will walk it into the offensive end. And no reaction from the Houston bench. I don't know if they're aware he has four. They have not sent a sub to the scores table. Alphon is in. I, I, I would go right at Scola until they make that substitution. One point ball game. Here's Yao down. Wow. He just, he just basically willed that thing in, didn't he? He just like tilted forward and dropped it home. 59, 56. Back tap by Skinner, but McGrady comes up with it. Foul on score on number five. That's what happens. They couldn't get the guy there quick enough. They couldn't get him out of the game quick enough. Maybe they should have called him 20 second time out to do yeah. it. Yeah. I need to see the coach. There you see the player bleeding. So Landy will come in. Just, I mean, Barron just kind of like didn't couldn't tell whether he was going to go in front or behind. And so the Clippers within three. Well, they got they got the start they needed. Though. Skinner, the kick, the Cayman. Running left-hander off the glass. Very nice. Cayman's been terrific. Clippers back within one. They're making everything this half. What a start to the half. Eight out of ten field goals. There's Yao again. Rebound Landry goes to get it. That's how to be called. Loose ball against the Clippers. It's one of those undersized power forwards hurting the Clippers in the offensive glass again. Thornton gets the foul. But watch Chris Cayman. Yeah, how aggressive has he been? Instead of catching and thinking, just go, catching the ball, going right to his left hand. He made 7 out of 12 shots. He made 75% of his shots against Utah. That's the good news. The bad news, he only had four shots. Yeah, Wednesday night. Yeah. He only got four looks. Landry a long way. Olsen gets the basket. The steal by Baron Davis, a chance for the Clippers to take the lead for the first time tonight. Baron, the kick to Thornton. Get out of the key for three. In and out. Hope was the Clippers' first look at the lead, or a chance at the lead, all night long. Yeah, a quick spin against Skinner. Skinner knocks it away. Ah, uh, the big body of Brian Skinner paying dividends here. Can you imagine being six foot nine and coming up to the guy's shoulder? <laughs> I mean, he's, he's literally nine inches taller than the six nine Skinner. Yeah, yeah, me. 
All right, Cass will think about it. Foul's going to be called on Thornton. All he wanted to do was get fouled. You remember this play at the other end of the